And good morning, everybody. My name is Harpo, and welcome back to some Sky Factory. Uh, I'm unclear of what episode this is. Whatever. Episode, whatever. But yeah. Uh, last time we were here, we made this uh, epic... This epic cobblestone farm. We've just been... I've just been mining away. I've been doing a lot of AFK cobble farming. And let's see what we've got in the chest so far. Nearly half a double chest, so almost a full chest of of cobblestone. I made a bunch of slab furnaces for some reason. I don't know, I thought they would kind of stack up on e stack on top of each other, but no, there's still that gap in between. Just kind of gay, but that's okay. But yeah, I'm doing a lot of AK cobble farming, and if you don't know what that is, it's pretty simple. Uh, just make sure you have an air block. You'll see why in a second. Uh, an air block underneath you. You'll see why in a second. Um, what you're going to do is you're going to go to options, go to your controls, and uh, your attack, it's usually set on button one. But uh, change that to a button you don't normally use. I use equals, just because it's uh, easy and uh, no other. It's not used for anything else. Uh, once you're there, uh, I know I'm clicking, but nothing's happening, so I'm pressing equals, and now it's mining. So once you're there, make sure you're aimed at the air block so it stops and then mines, stops, mines. Now, what you're gonna do here, hold down the equals button and press F11. That'll take it off full screen. Oh, yeah, there. Kind of looks weird, but it'll take it off full screen. And if you let go of F, or let go of equals, then you're still mining. My hand is off the keyboard. And I just did this for, well, I just made like a bunch of picks. And I just let it go, and I got maybe 9 to 10 stacks, 9, 10, 12 stacks at a time, at a time, uh, doing this from like 8 picks. So it's pretty good. But it's not fast enough. So what we're gonna do today is automation. Let me F11. Oh, and if you go back into full screen, you'll still be mining. But uh, you can't really do anything else with this. You just have to let it go. Uh, if you press like E or anything, it stops. If you press T, it stops. You press anything uh, to kind of get out of the window and have your cursor, and you can go to something else on your other monitor. Uh, it all stops, which is kind of weird. But uh, I don't mind. Uh, I just had a, a stream going on on my other monitor and watched that for an hour or so while this was going. So yeah, back to button one. So yeah, there's all that. I'm gonna go. I made all these picks, but I guess I'm not gonna need them anymore. At least not now. Put that up. All right, so let's get started on automation. Let's put all that stuff in there. Yeah, I already showed you that. I tried to make a grinder, but to see if that would work on the, uh, the gravel ores or anything, but it didn't. That's okay. It's a lot of tools. All right, so automation. We're going to automate the cobble, cobble generator and the mob farm today. Well, we'll see about the mob farm. I don't know. It depends. And I did a lot of uh, mineral farming. i just been using a bunch of, bunch of gravel, the broken ores and stuff. Uh, and I got a bunch of flint, I got a bunch of coal, I got some more emeralds and diamonds, I got a lot of iron. So yeah, it's just been real good. I should probably start doing dust, maybe get some more different items, but that's okay. So let's get started on automation. Now, what you're going to need for uh, the automation of the cobble generator, you're going to need uh, something called like a transfer node and transfer pipes. Transfer, there we go. Oops, no, not two. All right. Transfer node, you want items, not liquids. Yeah. So items. Now this is uh, fairly simpler too. Uh, if you don't have that much redstone and you do have some ender pearls, I have some ender pearls and you have like four or five. So we're gonna use this recipe right here. It's two stone, a chest, uh, two redstone, an ender pearl, and a transfer pipe, which is this. And it's very simple, two glass, six stone slabs, and a piece of redstone in the middle. You get 32 of them, which is a lot. So let's get started on that. I need some. Uh, I need some sand, so I'm gonna go grab some sand real quick, and gather up a bunch of other resources that I might need. So I'm gonna lay down some of this cobble. I'm gonna actually. I needed some glass, so let me go to these furnaces. I'm gonna get some glass. No stone. Yeah, that's what I needed. So we're gonna cook some of that up. I'm gonna pound down some of these. Uh, 
cobblestone, get some sand, get some glass going, and I'll be back with you in just a second. I should have been more prepared for this, but that's okay. That's definitely enough. Yeah, I'm gonna go get this, I'll be right back. Okay, so I, uh, I've made two stacks of transfer pipes. That's quite a lot. Let's just go ahead and make some more, uh, what is it? Stone slabs. Like that, divide them up, do this, do this. Glass on the sides, and redstone in the middle. Another stack. Awesome. So, that's a lot of transfer pipes. I don't know if we need this many, but I have them just in case. So, uh, next we need to make the transfer node, which is this one. I need some more stone. I need a chest. So let's continue cooking up some stone. We'll do 16. Put 8 in there, put 8 in there. Cool. Alright, so let's go see uh, if I have any ender pearls. I should have some ender pearls. I haven't really been to this mall park in a long time, which will automate this so I don't have to worry about it ever again. Oh my god. Oh, it's just a baby creeper. It should not explode. Do you do the fireworks? Because you're so cute. Four ender pearls, that's awesome. And when you kill a baby creeper, you get a small patty gunpowder. It's so cute. Okay. So, no? Don't do it. That's why I want to get that automated. Look at that tree. That's a big tree. Got the ender pearls. Got some transfer pipes. What is it? I need stone and some chests. Alright. So this should be pretty much almost done. Okay, so that. Uh, two chests. I'm gonna go make one more. Ah. Eight. Awesome. Make one more chest, and we'll have, I think, three transfer pipes. Yeah. Cool. Alright, so we have this. So let's. This one. Alright, so we'll look at this. Alright. Uh, we can make three. Two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Gotta save at least one ender pearl for. Um, the mob farm. Uh, we'll get to that in a second. Uh, enough redstone. You get redstone from, uh, receiving dust. So, you know, and dust you get from, uh, using a hammer on, uh, cobblestone, then gravel, then sand, and you get dust. And, uh, put the dust through the sieve, and you should get some, uh, some redstone. Or, I don't know if it has to be dust, but that's when I got it. Okay, so, oh, that makes quite a lot, but whatever. Cool. Now we have all of that. I didn't mean to make that much because I forgot how much it makes, but that's okay. All right, so we have a bunch of these. So let's go and put uh, excess stuff in here. Bro, put it there. This can go in there. This can go right there. That can go right there. And I got another spoils bag. It was a tier one one, and I didn't get much. I got another bear claw, and uh, I got some iron, and that was about it, pretty much. Um, so I put this hammer up. What am I doing? Oh, yes. Forgot. Let's go ahead and grab this stone so it's not in the furnaces anymore. Put it up, and we'll get started on this. Okay, so it's fairly simple. Once you have your transfer nodes, I'm going to grab a pickaxe real quick. Once you have your transfer nodes, you are going to want to, uh, Put them on the piece of cobblestone that is being generated. So this one being generated. All right, you're gonna want to put it on uh, either side. You can you actually have multiple if you want it. Um, that's I think I'm gonna do two or three. So we're gonna put one here, and let's right click on it. You can see it's already being uh, filled up, and these are upgrade slots. We'll do those uh, later on when we have more resources. But it's already filling up, and look at that, past half a stack. So let's put it on another side, and boom, it's just filling up almost at a quarter of a stack, so awesome. So from there, can we put one more? Yes, we can. And look at that, already filling up. That one's pretty much done. This one should be, yeah, oh my gosh. So much cobblestone. From here, you're going to want to use the transfer pipes, and just put, shift click, put one right there, put one right there, put one right there. Do that, we'll do that. Um, I don't know where I want these to go. You know, like a little barrel, uh, you could use barrels, 
uh, they would hold a lot more. So I think I'm gonna do that. Um, break that. Break that. Actually, no. Put. All right. So I have all of these. Let me get them connected. There we go. There's that one's connected. That one's connected. Cool. Seems a bit bulky, but that's okay. I can still get in and out. Cool. Awesome. So we have this. Uh, I'm gonna make a. Um, so many. I want to make a barrel room going this way, or ch big chest room, or something, going that way. So I'm gonna make that real quick. Uh, and uh, oh yeah, grab some of this. Get some of this over here. Yeah, I'm gonna make a big chest room or something, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I've made a little chest or barrel room, whatever, over here. Uh, this is where everything will be going. Um, I think, yeah, we'll just do barrels for now, because uh, they can store a little bit more. <sighs> so how to make a barrel. Alright, uh, we're going to use the Java mod. Uh, the Java mod stands for just another better barrel something. A. Just another better barrel, A. So uh, we'll do at Java. Cool. Uh, and this is a better barrel. Basically, how to make a better barrel, you need seven logs, a chest, and a plank of any kind. So let's... Oh, I'm asleep real quick. Okay, let's grab some, uh, let's grab some slabs, let's grab some logs, and we will make a barrel. Multiple barrels. Let's grab some slabs. I don't know how many we're going to need, but let's grab some... That we'll grab uh, make some chests. I don't know how many I'm gonna make, but I'm just gonna make as many as I can with what I have. So this looks like six. Uh, there's that and this. Where did you go? There you go. And that. Cool. We'll get six out of this. Cool. Six barrels. Uh, should be enough, maybe. All right. So head back down here. Okay, so I want to leave room for the pipes. So we'll just put that, 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 that. Oh, I need one more to make it symmetrical, unless I go crazy. Got to make one more. Sorry. Actually, two. Ugh. So we have another barrel. We're going to place it down right here. Cool. And these are all empty. They can hold a maximum of 64 stacks. Well, uh, chests can hold... What is it? I think it's... Chests are 9x6s. Yeah. Yeah, 9x6s. It's 54. So that can hold uh, 54 stacks. And this can hold 64. So 10 more stacks. Which is awesome. So let's uh, let's grab our transfer pipes. I believe you just have to. Do you, I don't think you need. Yeah, you can just do this. Cool. Coming around. Uh, I don't know what that's gonna do. I probably should. Uh, I'll be fine. Bring it around on both sides, because I can. Run it along the fences. Yeah, whatever. Uh, I'm gonna have to make this walkway wider. Yeah. Whatever. So we have this. Do that. Do this. Do that. This, that. This. Can I jump on these? Yes, I can. And look at that. It's already filling up. But why is nothing else filling up? Oh, there it goes. It's just taking a while because it's really long. It's already at two plus two stacks plus twenty-seven. That's a lot. So awesome. Oh, cool. So yeah, it's a lot of cobble. So I'm gonna go ahead and take all of these. I don't know why I have these. 
be gone. And you can add uh, upgrades to these uh, as time goes on, like mining upgrades, speed upgrades, and stuff like that. Uh, but we'll do that later. I, think I could probably put one on the bottom of this, but uh, whatever. We'll do that later. So well, that's how you do it. All right, so. Oh. Well, I already filled that one up. It's already halfway full. Awesome. So cobble is now automated. That's fantastic. Fantastic. And it's going at a pretty fast rate, too. I mean, like three stacks every 10, 15 seconds, I would guess. So that's, that's pretty good. So now, now that this is done. I'm going to need to put more barrels. I'll do that later. But uh, now that that's done, uh, let's get started on automating uh, this farm. Now, which iron do I have? Going to need a few things. 9, 12, 15, 17, 19, and it makes 4. And a 22, so I should have enough. So let's take all that. Uh, I need to make another chest for this type of stuff. Do that. Okay. So let's make it organized real quick. Oh, come on. Don't do that to me. Alright. We have a chest. Put it right there. Uh, put this type of stuff in there. Awesome. Okay, so let me make uh, some swords. Three I needed. One, two, three. And then I needed a block. So it should be this, this, and this. Yeah. And I need more iron. Okay. So yeah, that gives you iron spikes. So make some of those if you have the iron. Make sure you, yeah, you need a lot of iron for this. Uh, five sticks, I don't need you. Let me go put those up. Uh, I need to get some more iron. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to... I think I'm going to uh, go hammer some cobblestone. Uh, get some more... Uh, what is it? Broken iron? I just need... Really, I just need one more, because I need to make a hopper, and a hopper takes five iron, and I only have four. So yeah. Uh, where is my... this one. <laughs> so yeah, I'll be uh, right back. I need to go make uh, some more... get some more iron. So I'm gonna just pound, up some, pound up some gravel, and I will be right back. Oh, it's just... Oh yeah, to get... okay. To get cobblestone into the barrel, right click with it. To take it out, left click. All right, cool. Cool, cool, cool. And to lock it, you shift, left click. And I think shift, right click puts it in one at a time or something. I don't know. But yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so I got a broken iron, so let's uh, let me throw this in there. So I can make, actually I can make a lot of these. And I got this. Cool, and I can make some more aluminum. Cool, so let's go and put these into ore form. All right, so let's get this iron going. That's the main priority. Ooh, we got an emerald. I didn't even see that. Let's do that. Wait for the iron to smelt. This in here, five emeralds. It's awesome. I don't know what emeralds are used for. Uh, most likely using them for Tinker's Construct. Uh, maybe, but uh, unless I find another use for him, which I probably will. Let's grab all this stuff. Cool, cool. So, this stuff in here. Give me the at. I'll be out of iron. Oh no. Seven, okay. Alright, I'm gonna make a hopper. Uh, you'll see why in a second. Chest. Hopper. Iron spikes. Okay. Uh, to make an automated mob farm, 
uh, you're going to need a couple things. You need the iron spikes, which we made, and you're going to need a vacuum. Oops, why am I caps lock? Vacuum hopper. Oh, it's two U's. Yeah, two U's. Vacuum hopper. And obsidian. I'm cooking more lava right now. Uh, obsidian, a hopper, and an ender pro. We have one ender pro left. We just made the hopper. And I'll make a vacuum hopper. So let me see if I... Is that enough lava to grab with a bucket, or do I need to make more? God diggity. Need to make more. Okay, so... Oh yeah, it's all over here now. So I'll be right back once I have uh, me some obsidian. I'll grab a stack of this. Yeah, go grab uh, me up some obsidian and I'll be right back. Yeah, I was wrong about the barrels. Um, shift right click locks it. Shift left click gets one at a time. And then just left click to take a stack out. Shift left click takes one. And then right click puts all of it in and then I think if you let me grab some no if I do yeah if you just hold down right click it puts everything all of your items into the barrel so yeah um, I don't know how far along the lava is uh, we'll find out in a second but um I have a bucket so it's come on what I think it's full of lava. Can I pour water over it? Might be a bad idea. Oh, I'll wait a few more minutes. I'll be right back. Okay, I finally got a lava bucket. Awesome. I don't know why that took so long. I got a lava bucket, so let's make a little area where I can get me some obsidian. So the Grab four. Come right here. That little thing. Get me a water bucket. And we'll pour this lava right there. And pour that over it. And we get obsidian. How are we going to mine it? I don't know. I have three diamonds. Yes. Awesome. I now just thought about how to mine that. Ah, oh. You saved me, diamonds. Yes. Or I can make a tinker's pick. Nah, we'll get into tinkers later. Oh. Completely forgot about that. Whew. Oh, excuse me. Awesome. Come here, my obsidian. We'll get more diamonds later. I mean, it's not that difficult. I have a bunch of cobblestone. I can just break it down to gravel and sieve the gravel again. Get more diamonds. And that trick with the AFK cobble farming that I showed you about going into full screen and all that, you can do that with sieving as well. And I did that for like four stacks of gravel. And I got a lot of stuff. So awesome. So now we have that. We need an ender pearl. I'm going to put this cobblestone up in here. Cool. Got one barrel already full. That one's almost. Damn it. <laughs> Dang it. Ah. There. That one's almost full. Yeah. It's awesome. Ow. Thank you, dog. Scratched my foot. Let's put this. Put, no, put that there. And we need an Ender Pearl. Ender Pearl is here. Cool. All right. To make it, I think it was just this, that, and that. Yeah. Awesome. Now we have those two items. We're gonna need. I'm gonna go ahead and make. No, I have chests down there. Yeah. Okay, so. Um. 
I want I don't want anything else spawning, so we're gonna kill off these. Ooh, I got a skeleton's head. Cool. Okay. Oh I'm missing one more thing. Where is it? Fan. Oh my god, that's so much iron. I need s seven iron. It makes one fan? Oh my god. Ah, oh, that's so much stuff. I should have been better prepared, I completely forgot. Oh, you need a fan. Two fans, if, depending on your design. Uh, it'll depend on how many fans you need. I, I need two, one here, and one at the other end. Essentially what that's gonna do is push the mobs into the center where the iron spikes will be, and uh, that'll kill them, all their drops will get sucked into the vacuum hopper and into chests. Essentially that's the design. That is, ah, oh, gosh. I'll be right back when I have some iron. Uh, give me some more gravel, some more iron, and a bunch more ores. They're all cooking up in the furnaces. Uh, I did four stacks of gravel, and uh, look what I got. I got a bunch of flint, a bunch of coal, and four diamonds out of that. So, I totally would have had seven, but whatever. I got four out of four stacks, which is pretty good. It's one per stack. I got some more uh, lapis, and uh, I got a bunch more stuff uh, just cooking over here. I got so much iron, bunch of tin, aluminum, platinum, gold, silver, nickel, lead, and copper. Grab that. All right, 14, I think, is how much we needed uh, to make uh, the fans. That's what we're making. Okay, so let's put all this stuff up in here. So do, 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 do bunch of stuff a bunch of stuff okay so we needed to make some of those oh we needed stone slabs do we have any stone yes we do cool all right put that back cool uh, I think it was that that oops and that yes two fans fantastic didn't mean to do that oops funds for days uh stone slabs are apparently very useful so we'll put those in there put that there i liked it like that uh what do i have a wooden pickaxe i'll keep it just in case you never know let me go gather up these uh, rest of these ores, and we'll get started on the automation of the mob farm. Cool. Lead, copper, silver, and tin. Awesome. So much stuff. Okay, so um, hope oh, let me grab a sword. Actually, no, I think there are swords over there that we can use. Gotta eat. Looks like we have a creeper, a skeleton, and some zombies. Nothing too bad. I do have some swords in here. Time to die. And we'll get started on this, and everything will be awesome, nice, and flowing. I think I'm just gonna set up a bunch of chests. We'll do barrels later. Awesome. Cool, cool, cool. Oh, it's only got one left. Bye. Should can take those away. Um, let me see this. Let me see this. Okay. Cool. Alright, so we need those. We need one of these. Okay. So... Cool. Now, as you can see, I'm not... Oh, shit. Oh, I forgot about this. Um, you can see, I... Alright, the fan is pushing me. I'm not touching the keyboard. It's just moving me right along. That's what we want, so let's put one right 
there as well. And it kind of evens out in the middle, so let's break this block. Place an iron spike. And then... Let me go grab some slabs and stuff. So yeah, so far you just need... Uh, oh, they push you really far, so they should... Uh, all the mobs should go on this spike. I don't know how many... One should be enough, we'll see. Uh, we'll make it bigger as time goes on. The fans will push them into the center. Uh, that'll... The mobs will start taking damage. And then... Um, all their items will get sucked up into that vacuum hopper. So let's... Give me some slabs. That'll do. Maybe some fences, just in case. Uh, need that. Put that up. Alright. How's this doing? Wow. Fills up nearly every barrel. Wow. Awesome. So, with this the way it is now, this iron spike um, is letting light in. So, if I press F7, uh, there are only three red X's right now and four yellow ones on each side. So, we need to fix that. So, let's head on to over here. And I think if you just place a slab on the. Actually. Yeah, I think you just have to place a slab there. So, let's remove that block. Don't need it. Okay, let's go to this side. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna have to do this. Yeah, you need the slabs uh, on the spike like this on this level, like the lower level of the spike, uh, to uh, make it dark again. To like up, like I guess update the light levels or whatever or something. I don't know. Or change the light levels. So let me just make the all right, cool. So we have this, we can walk around. Go ahead and do that. Just cause. Why not? Alright. So from here, let's remove this. Remove this. Cool. Okay, so hopefully the fans don't kill me. far enough away, so let's surround this in a fence. I don't know how big I need to make this room. So, okay, so alright, we have this. Let's grab a chest. Let's grab, put a chest for now. Actually, we'll do this. Um, I need to move it up one. Put it right there. Or so, yeah. You'll see what once once it's all done, you'll kind of see what I'm going after. All right. No, no, no. All right. No. Where do I place it? Where can I place it? Hmm. My design's kind of not very good. I only got two red X's. I'm really lighting in light. I don't want that. Let's configure. Oh my gosh. There we go. Okay, um, huh, I don't really know uh, what to do right there. I can move it out one, I guess. Trial and error, it's all, it's all you have to do. Just trial and error. Keep trying things until you find something that works. 
But I know this is one of the simple, most simple ways that you can do this. I really should have brought an axe. There, okay, so what if we put it there? Mine. No, not that. And then we, we're gonna throw something right here. Eh. Well, it's sucking them up, so that's good, I guess. Okay, I guess this kind of works. Um, we'll put this... We'll just put a chest right there. Let's configure this. Like this. And we'll uh, throw a chest right there. And it gets sucked into the chest. Cool. So let's... No. Put that stuff in there. Cool. Hopefully this works. Uh, if not, um, and I'll just do something else, like maybe a hopper system or something. I don't know, but we'll just see if this works for now. I hope so. Seven. So yeah, something like this. The mobs in your, your mob farm, uh, it kind of needs to be long. You can't just have a little square one. At least maybe not, I don't know. But um, have it so... Uh, the mobs are being pushed into some iron spikes. Uh, have a vacuum hopper somewhere close by, uh, and that uh, pointing into a chest. And for that, you just XP outputs. Uh, I don't know. We'll do that later. Uh, have the vacuum hopper facing a chest. Depending on your direction, uh, it will. Well, that's cool. Yeah. Uh, just make sure that it's pointing into the chest. So if I were like facing this direction, I did this, and I did that, um, the little output thing will be on this side, if I'm on this side, oh, now it's a double, I don't want that, but yeah, I'm on this side, when I do this, it's right there, so yeah, you can kind of get how it is, just make sure you're kind of facing like this way, and then pop it into the chest, so yeah, so um, we'll, I'll do some uh, AFK farming, I'm gonna quickly upgrade the storage on uh, the uh, cobble farm, and uh, I'll be right back with you guys. So yeah, be back in a second. Okay, look at that. It's working. They're being pushed into the spikes, and they're taking damage. Got some creepers. Thank you for demonstrating this. Cool. I don't see any drops. Yeah, that's more gunpowder than we started with, I think. I don't think we had 20, so yeah. And I just made some more barrels uh, for uh, the cobble farm over there. Cobble farm. Sounds weird. But yeah, so far, everything's working. So I think, I think I can call it here, this episode. We've finally done some automation. I really want to get some tree automation done. I hate chopping them down and stuff. So much, but I really like the way it looks. It just makes it feel so natural. Oh gosh, look at all this. How are you going to lock them all? I don't know what locking them does, but it does something. Yeah, I think I'm going to... I think I'm going to call the episode here. Uh, it's been, it's taken, uh, over an hour to record this whole thing, which, I mean, it's not long, but, uh, it's getting really kind of late for me. I've already recorded uh, a little bit today, I recorded some Tomb Raider, and this took longer than I expected. I wanted to get, um, some other stuff done. I don't know if I need all these pipes. I wanted to get some other recordings done. Uh, some different games that I want to start playing, uh, just for fun, kind of games. Like I'm gonna do a new, new big series with a bunch of little series called Time to Kill. Just when I'm really, 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 really bored, uh, and I don't feel like doing this or uh, playing Tomb Raider, which is I always feel like playing Tomb Raider. Or, you know, going on this, making sure I have everything. And look at that, die, die, 
uh, coming on here, making sure everything's working, making sure I have some stuff. Uh, but, uh, yeah, the Time to Kill series is just a bunch of random games. Like, I'll just look through my Steam library, and I'll just pick a game, and we'll play it. So, I am going to move this later. We'll, we'll get some, like, lava automation going, maybe. I don't know. Something along those lines. Or we'll just... I need to take a look at the challenge lists, and that's not good. Ooh, a thing. Uh, I'm gonna set up some more spikes. Cause it's not, cause they're getting stuck like that. That's not good. But yeah, uh, I'm starting, yeah, no series, as I said. Uh, so I'm gonna... Ooh, it's getting... It's getting darker. It's weird. New series, just cause I'm bored. And, uh... Get on the spike. Drop. I don't care. Let's do this. I need more, more slabs. But the the new series, just look at my Steam library and all that fun stuff. Uh, see what I have. Play some games. Uh, I have. I'm playing a lot of Need for Speed lately, so I might do that. I'm a. It's a fun game, and I'm a big car guy, so it's my kind of game. Go real fast. Okay, let's so grab some slabs. So yeah, I'm gonna call it here. I uh, hope you enjoyed. Hope this helped. Uh, you kind of get further in your Sky Factory if you're still playing Sky Factory. I hope you helped you get further in it. Uh, I had a lot of fun. Oh, I need to. Now I need to do this. I'm having a lot of fun with this mod pack. It's nice to finally do something kind of different. Um, you know, instead of the normal punching trees and all that stuff. You know, just punching trees, getting wood, and then mining down, get diamonds and all that. Uh, no, you went in here. Give me that. Large magic jar. I don't know. What do you do? Oh, well. Give me that fence. Awesome. So, yeah. Sorry. I just keep... Procrastinating. That'll do it for this episode of Sky Factory. Again, I uh, hope you enjoyed. Hope this helped. Um, I'll be doing a maybe. Uh, I don't know when I'll be recording again. I tried to get as much done as I could today, uh, which wasn't very much, which is okay. Um, I still have a lot of footage to edit, uh, stuff like that. So, uh, yeah, I'll be. I got a lot of work ahead of me. Then I'll put out these videos. So yeah. Uh, that'll do it for this episode of Sky Factory again. Hope you enjoyed. Hope this helps. Oh my gosh, why am I going to keep saying that? Goodbye, everybody. Uh, have a nice day, and I'll catch you next time. Goodbye.